London 360, we're here with Paris here, director of Mercenaries. Can you just tell us a little bit about what we're going to see from Mercenaries here? Um, Mercenaries on the whole is a uh, action movie um, with a, a kind of slightly uh, slight love story, like you know, that, like threads through. Die Hard? Um, not Die Hard. Not Die Hard. It's never actually like consummated, <laughs> okay. but um, it's set in the Balkans. It's a what if story um, that's loosely based on uh, Radko Miladic and Radovan Karadic that were at large after the last Balkan conflict. Um, and uh, when Radovan Karadic was captured, I, I had this kind of like brain spark and thought, what if Ratko Miladic, the, the last of the three dictators who's still at large, came back out of hiding after 15 years post-Balkan conflict and picked up where he left off, what would happen and what would be the reaction of the US and the British like, you know, uh, governments. And it's that kind of story. Yeah. What inspired you to make a film like this? I mean, you could have made a film about anything, you know, thriller or anything. What inspired you to make an action film? Um, I think that I'm a, I'm a writer-director and I want to basically try every genre. My last um, feature was a, a, a bank robbery, a heist movie, and I wanted to steer away from anything similar. Like, I didn't want to do any kind of gangster films or anything like that, although I was being offered certain screenplays that were kind of gangster-based. Um, and I didn't want to be typecast as that kind of director. Um, you wanted to keep the horizons, you know, you wanted to broaden your horizons. Yeah, exactly. I wanted to show like, you know, a little bit of, like that. I was an eclectic director, I'm a creative artist, and I, I, I decided that I would do something in action because there were some producers that had been asking me to work with them on gangster movies that then... And you've done gangster movies before, haven't you? Yeah, I have, yeah. Um, you just don't want to be yeah, typecast, obviously, because obviously some directors in the industry get typecast with being a gangster or exactly, action. Or like exactly, that. exactly. So. Um, I decided to like pitch a, an action movie to them and um, I already had a location down in East Sussex that belonged to a friend of mine called Pippin for the State and I had written this screenplay basing it around the estate um, and it could double as the Balkans or it could double as Africa even if we put a lot of red like soil on the ground and, um, and they said yeah let's do this Balkan story so there were two screenplays, Mercenaries were the one that um, got picked up and we went from there.